Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Prue. I go by Prue LaRue on all of my socials, which feel free to follow or subscribe, whatever floats your boat. I've already done a basic face right now, but what I really wanted to try was the full contour. I've never actually done it to my face and I thought it would be fun to do. On um, my lips, because I probably will forget, is one of the, from the Anastasia Minis Hudson. Uh, with MAC Morning Coffee Lip Pencil. It's very dark and brown, but I feel like the 90s are coming back. I'm wearing the new Hourglass Scattered Light in Aura on my eyes, and that is all I have plus some liner, which I pointed up on this side. And mascara, Oops, I've already put it away. No, it wasn't that one. Why do I do this to myself? I must not put it away. My, I don't know, it's the uh, YSL sample I got from Social Zoo. And I am wearing, our, oh, I've got Benefit Poor Professional under this one. And the Prep and Prime from MAC onto this side. We can zoom in. And just my Hourglass Vanish Foundation in gel. And NARS Vanilla Concealer under my eyes. I got the Tartist World Pro Glow. And then I've also got the lovely Kevin O'Corn book. Which is the picture I'm taking from. He does say, don't go too heavy handed. But I thought I'd just have fun and see what I look like. This is the palette. And yeah, this one smashed on the way, but I repressed it. It, it seems to be okay. But I thought I'll dig into, I think this is a contour shade down here. Oh, sculpt. I'll use this one. I will use my hourglass. The sample I got from the Mecca B loot box last oh, four months ago. Is it four months? No, three months. I haven't had it that long. I don't know why they do this to me. This. We're gonna use this tiny little dude. My Jessup fancy looking thing. Oh, the Jessup L50. They've started labeling them. Oh, that was a powder. I kind of want to do creams. Sorry, I'm just going to use my color swatch. Well, my AliExpress one. Clean that off. Perfect. And go into the cream. So we're going to use shade from this palette. Just solely because I'm never going to use it otherwise. Whew. Alright, that's uh, fierce. I just rubbed it off. This so is the first stroke, second one. All right. So there's done like a line here, line here, line here, and one like that. One here, one here, one off the air. I just love playing with makeup, really. So I wanted to see what this looks like. Um, oh, it seems to have gone up further. So let's do like the full triangle here. Yeah, that seems like a great idea. All right, and then what got me into this idea was doing the chin.
I feel like there's more places you should put it. Oh, the nose one. What is this? Mm, this is too big. I think that's all the places. Alright, well, I might as well blend it in. So. I'm just going to blend that into the hairline. Oh. Fierce. See, that just looks almost comical to me. Well, it looks okay further away. And then I think you blend it down, is that what I've always been told? Whoa. This product goes so far. I think it would be extremely impossible to pan this unless you were like a working makeup artist. Because this was only a smidge. I think my biggest problem is like not knowing exactly where to put it all. See, because this just looks ginormous, it's gone so far. So, I'm gonna cut this a little bit. And just try and fix it by bringing my foundation back in. Yeah, I think that looks a lot better. Alright, now for the tiny highlighter. So it's pretty much put this everywhere, I think. Oh. My nose looks dirty. better I think and then it's pretty much put highlighter everywhere and I shall not use this brush again because I that product is everywhere so this is the champagne flash You know what? I didn't do my brows. I knew I was going to forget something.
think this needs some bush. Mm. I, just, I just like putting this on everything. <sighs> Fluffy one, Jessup. 221, soft and relax. Well, the nars the hourglass came out first. Let's like stipple it on today with the buffing brush from Eco Beauty. Yeah, I mean, like, I think it looks fine. Well, thanks for watching.